Are you trying to match with your car? Huh? What'd you say? You trying to match with your car? What kind of what? What'd you say? You're trying to match with your car? Yeah. Look at this guy. Mustang owners, guys. Look. You know where you remind me of? A red Power Ranger. You know how they usually have, That's like... That's actually what I was going for. Oh, so hold up. You're a, you're actually a Power Ranger. You want to <laughs> tell them about that? Welcome back to the vlog, ladies and gentlemen. We got another awesome video coming for you guys. We are actually headed to Mexico. Yes, it's going to be a far drive, but it's going to be well worth it. Today, we're going to be racing a Corvette C7. So, the deal with this Corvette is we've raced it before. We've beat it back when he was stock. But we barely won, so I think I won by maybe three quarters of a car, maybe a car, I'm not really sure, I don't remember, but all I know is I beat it and it was close. So now he has an intake and he's on E85. That's pretty much all he's telling me he did to the car. I'm kind of scared. I think I'm going to lose. I don't know. I don't know. If I barely beat him when he was stock and now he's modified making like 40, 45 wheel horsepower more than he did before according to him. Um, I think, I don't know, I might lose. I, I, I don't know, but I mean, I'm crossing my fingers. Hopefully, we could take the W home. The Corvette is a lot lighter than my car. It's about 3,371 pounds. I'm at, I don't know, I would say this car is like 37, 3,800 pounds. So we're pretty much driving to Mexico right now to meet him up, um, talk to him, and then pretty much go out there and do some runs. The ideal roll for me would be like a 40 roll, but I'm on stock tires right now and I can't hook. I'm gonna try to do a couple of test hits before you know we get to the spot. If it can hook from 40, then I'll do 40, but if we can't, then I'll do a 60 roll and uh, we'll see how it goes. I mean, the Corvettes are pretty fast off the roll, so we're gonna cross our fingers and hopefully we can take this W home. If not, I'm gonna go home and get the red eye. I'm just kidding. All right guys, so we made it to the spot. Here we got my Mustang. So what's done to this car is E85 and intake. Obviously it's tuned. I got a little bit of suspension work, but intake and E85 and it's obviously tuned are the only performance modifications to this. It is on stock tires right now. So it is on the 275s back here. Here is the Corvette. So like he said, it has an intake and it's on E85 and it's way lighter than this car. Talk to me, Dakota. What, what do you think is gonna happen? Gonna Our fellow Power Ranger. What do you think? Mustang's gonna take the dog. You think? You think so? Yeah. He's more confident in my car than I am. I don't because know. Because if this wins, then that makes my car look bad. Oh. So, I gotta go. So he he he's just kind of he's riding for the team is basically what's go. going on here. Okay, okay. Family okay. at the end of the day, we go. Okay, for family. It. Okay, I get it. You know, <laughs> Mustang, Mustang family. But anyways. Let me know what you guys think, guys. This thing looks good, but it's dirty. You need to give this thing a wash. Huh? You need a wash. Okay, look, if you beat me, I'll wash it. <laughs> All right, so that's this fuel sensor for the ED5. Okay. You put that in, you can run ED5 in the car, and then this. You have intake. injectors? No. And then you got the intake? Yeah. Power-wise, what does it make, like 410 wheel? Like, realistically, because I already looked online. Uh, well, I'll show you down the sheets. I made 418 wheel. So as you guys can see, I have a JLT intake, no headers whatsoever, no headers in here. JLT intake, and it's on E, no injectors, I don't really have to do anything to run E. So this car makes 470 wheel, and this car makes 418 wheel. Um, this car weighs, what would you say it weighs? Like 30, 3298, so lighter than I thought. 3298, this thing weighs like a little over 3700 pounds. So there's a what 400 pound difference and I'm making about 50 wheel more than this but weight obviously you know comes into play you know when you're racing cars especially off a road. So let me know in the comments below who do you guys got winning the Mustang or the C7 Corvette. I actually think the Corvette's gonna win just because of how it performed the first time I raced him. When I first raced him, he was like right there with me and it's the same mods as it was before. Um, the only difference is just the revised tune over time. So I don't know how it's gonna go, but we're about to head out to Mexico and get it done. All right, we're entering Mexico right now. Put it in drag strip mode. I shut the traction button off, so not all the way, just once.
That thing is fast. That was fire. We'll, we'll do one more. I won't hook. We'll just do one more 60 after that. to talk real quick so there you guys go those were all 60s the first one I think he redlined the second one it was very 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 close I thought I was a nose ahead before I shut down the third one I had him by a half a car we're gonna go out and do a couple more just to see kind of where it sits all right let's head out Oh my god, that was that was a close one. Is he be he came behind after us? Oh my Whew, guys. I, let off right away. I'm like, oh. I know dude guys we're about to do like our third run or whatever and then all we see is a sheriff. I wasn't even paying attention to the radar and we just came here and like hid behind this building. Oh my god, that was a very close one. The Mexican authority almost caught us racing. My radar was going off, but I just was not paying attention because I muted it. So, um, that was close. But we did a lot of good racing. Um, wow, that was good. That was good. The racing was good. But Be before this one, before we were racing around the turns, it was like even, dude. Yeah. It was f***ing even. The turn? My car's going side just because of the radius. Yeah, I felt I felt a little yeah. weird. I don't know if the spacers are, you know. I felt really uh, weird. Yeah. And then I, that's why I just let off when there was a car. But the other one, the first one we did, it was like even. Oh, here's the cop. Said violin music. Wow. For your tribute to your mom. Let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of those races? This vet is pretty quick. Like, I don't want you guys to sleep on the car. The car is lighter. The car is making 418 wheel horsepower. And I think we did pretty good. I did get him on a few of those runs. And then the other ones, it was even. So awesome, awesome races. Uh, shout out to him for coming out and racing. All right, the vet's leaving. All right, be safe. <laughs> that thing was quick. What do you think? Totally from the beginning, bro. Power Rangers all day. He, look, look, look. <laughs> He went with the Mustang. I didn't lose. I, I got him one one run I got him. And the other one when we were coming back, I got him by a like a I think it was a fender. He never got ahead of me ever. So it was a pretty close race. I got I I got two W's from what, what I've seen and from what you guys can see from the video. So you guys be the judge. Let me know what you guys think happened because honestly. We can say anything we want, the video doesn't lie. You guys can go back, rewind it, see what it did. But it was really good runs. That vet is really, really fast. But now it's finally time to let you guys go. So if you guys like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you are subscribed. Tons of more racing content coming your way. And now I'm gonna let you guys go. So peace out and stay out the way. Hey, what's up guys, Motor Tube. Power Ranger right here. You know. We got four bets out here. You know, it's nothing big. It's out. We're out here.